Okay, these are hidden cities or villages of Antarctica. This is located just north of Greenland. There's a series of islands. There's a Google Earth. This is a tool, and I used a recording device. Um, and, and basically all I did was just change the contrast and made shadow and uh, light. Uh, played with it so we could see what's being hidden um, and you'll notice too there's an anomaly where you can drill down to the lowest altitude in Google Earth but if you keep drilling down even though you're stuck it could sometimes breaks through to a different dimensional area you can see sometimes inside the caves or inside uh, the, the buildings it's very strange so I think this is what happened and that's why I was able to see what I can see but there are some strange anomalies and large structures that are clearly not organic in nature. They're symmetric and um, um, terrestrial made or inner terrestrial made. So there's some significant um, discoveries I have found. The structures on the moon and on Mars are the same is one of these villages. They are more of the Davons, not demons, but daemons, which are the elemental beasts, crystal worlds, the, the angelic, demonic world. This is the king of matter, who, you know, Christians say that Satan rules the world. Well, the world is material. The physical three-dimensional plane of existence we're on currently is ruled by the chief archon, which are the devil. Um, and he's also in charge of nature, which is... Um, so he has a task to do. He was summoned by um, God in order to collect negative energy and, and, and take it out of the... Uh, it's like cancer, and it needs to be taken out of humanity's body before we die. So if you notice too, if we're scrolling in, this village has triangular windows, very organic, but still using the rocks as formations to make more like what birds do in cliffs to make bird nests. There's also a tree of life that's just extraordinary, and it looks like it's inside a dome um, right here. If you see where the bottom is, it looks like there's a white dome, and there's the tree of life. There's that bunny rabbit frozen. <laughs> See so the ears in his mouth. Now I don't know if it, if they're you know indoors and we're looking through the window or it's they're under ice or what it is. But for me not to continually see these same faces I see over and over and over, it's impossible um, not to see the same characters as I see time and time again. There are seven fallen angels. The main one being. Um, Lucifer, and they all have very distinct uh, faces, and you'll see that face manifest in many things, um, including chemtrails, and then these beings that we see um, around, you know, Moon and Mars, and soon to be Earth. We are going into the fourth D. Everyone says ascension into five D. Well, whatever happened to four D? Well, four D is hell, the hell realm. <laughs> It is the Hades, um, kind of. We're in Hades right now. And uh, we're, then we are ascending to the fifth. And you don't want to get off this elevator. This is the elevator that you stay on. <laughs> Japan thinks four is this, the number of death. And like our 13's unlucky, their unlucky number is four. And the fil old filament earth of the Gnostic Library of Christ, Jesus Christ, um, talks a lot about the the um, filament earth and how the chief archon but vast filament um, um, rules from this dimension in the second heaven which is four-dimensional reality the 4d is when you can look and see beings just hanging out on the surface of mars or beings that look just like spaceships and you're confused to know if they're a spaceship or